Hi, it's Jack Riccardi, and for just a minute, some days when we are figuring out the radio show, it is hard to know where to begin. But today, it is easy to know what we will start with. And we will start with a very difficult story. And it's the story of a young college student, Lakin Riley, who attended Augusta University in Georgia, and who was found murdered on a jogging trail. And the suspect in her murder is an illegal immigrant from South America, whose story is very familiar to us. He came into the country illegally in 2022. He, through a cascading series of bad policies and broken systems, wound up in New York, tangled with the criminal justice system in New York, split with his wife, went to Georgia to live with some other relatives. That's the story we're hearing. And they're describing his alleged murder, and he's innocent until proven guilty, of Lake and Riley as a crime of opportunity. In fact, the Associated Press wrote the story of the murder of Lake and Riley from the angle of, are you ready for this? From the angle of, well, these are the dangers that women athletes face. Like, if you're a woman and you decide to jog for health or fitness, well, this is something that might happen. How insulting. And how transparent. If anyone was in the wrong place in that fateful moment, we all know it wasn't Lake and Riley. In fact, as much as her death is a tragedy, and as much grief and pain as her family and friends and that college community must be going through, this is also a moment of clarity for everyone. No matter what your political stripes are, we all see this, and there is no way you can reframe it or spin it for anything else. Lake and Riley was not the one who should not have been on that jogging trail. So we'll talk about that today on our show, along with all the breaking news. We get started live at 4 on KTSA, and you can also find our show as an on-demand podcast at KTSA.com.